guys uh, guy who was on the plane with me and the guy who has his own rental car business this guy does yeah Carlos hey Carlos all right well how do we get in contact with Carlos if we need to okay all right yeah come on in okay guys all right Peter welcome to the Dominican Republic good to see you habla espanol Gino uh, poquito. <laughs> oh yeah, poky yeah, tone. Yeah, not, not that, good though. Huh? I gotta practice. Okay, good. I might need a little. Lady it's been friend many to teach years me. for me. So, are you gonna write a story about this? Do you think? This, uh, this it depends. Show? It depends. It depends on what I like. You know, I mean, is David Callahan gonna be here? Is uh, we are doing something. Over Eric there. Urban gonna. I, be we're here? gonna see his houses. I'm filming both of them. You did get that? Okay, yes, good. I'm filming both of those right, houses. Good. We are headed to Casa Tiki Skip Cabot. Casa Tiki Cabot. Oh, right. In uh, Cabrera. In Cabrera. Cabrera. Uh, I, I, it looked like it was on Route 5. Okay. So, route 5. Yeah, Route 5. And we're going to go all the way out here. And we're going to go to Cabrera. Right oh, here. gosh. That's so close. So, You're going to be the navigator. And let's let's head on over and see Skip. Okay. A Nantucket guy. There's Excellent. a big Nantucket connection here, isn't there? Huge connection. Almendra. Almendra. Almonds. Almendra. Almonds. Yeah, that's good. Right? You eat them? They sell them all over the place. Huh? Yeah. Huh? That's it. Cerveza? Cerveza? Wow. They got the big ones and the small ones. I'll have a small one, though. Huh? Uh, Smaller, large. Huh? How much was it? Huh? Sente? Say Santa? Say Santa. Who knows? Who knows? Are they good? También, eh, de aquí, eh, pequeño, oh, él comprende español. He, he speaks poquito. Ok. Eh, también, el dueño de esto, comprende el dueño, negocio, tiene un pequeño hotel aquí, Vista al Mar, muy lindo, con piscina. Tenemos un casa de amigo, Cabrera. It's lindo, Gabriel. Yeah, it's lindo. Muy lindo. The Spanish will slowly come back. Mm. It will. Nice. Those almonds are nice, aren't they? Interesting. Different. They need, like, salt or chili pepper or something. Huh? Yeah, they do. <laughs> How do you know Skip? Skip is the guy we're going to see right now. How do you know him? He's one of the first people I met on Nantucket, I think. Exactly. 70, 74, 75. Wow. Um, so you've known him that long? When his, when his parents had the guest house on uh, Center Street, Anchor oh, Inn. His parents had that? Guest house. Wow. And the attic, the attic was the... Uh, the hippie hangout. Del Wynn had an, a room, room up there. Uh, some of the maids who worked at the the B and B had had rooms up there, and uh, that's where the, the parties would, would start, right up there. You know? 
So how did you? How did your relationship grow from there? Yours and his. Um. We both started painting for Nobby Nobla. House painting? House painting. He had a business on the island. He did. Yeah. And uh, I went out on, a, on my own. Then about a year or two later, Skip went out on his own. We we joined forces and we had a painting. Company. What year was this? Was this, this what decade? Yeah, this must have been like late seventies, oh, okay. something like that. And. Uh, Skip uh, was a, was a hard-working guy, too hard-working for me. <laughs> I, I needed more time between houses. I needed I needed more. He he, he liked the big he crews all, and the he, big work. He and the good job. he worked all the time. So I went back on my own and uh, and took you know basically worked half the year and, and did travel writing in the in the winter. So took, right. Worked half a year, took took the rest off and right. did writing. Right. Um, but Skip kept into the businesses that he was doing. He went into the the bar business at the Muse. He yeah, owned the Muse. Yeah. Owned the Muse with Herbie Cabral. And, uh, Doesn't and, he own Stubbies right now? Well, now, yeah. That, afterwards, after he got rid of the Muse, he he did more painting and then uh, invested in Stub a couple places there. Stubbies. Uh, mm. The sandwich shop at the end. Oh really? I didn't realize. He's got like two sandwich shops there, and he's got he used to have the, the coffee place, coffee he? shop too. Yeah. He doesn't have that anymore, or no? I think he's still mine. Yeah, know. I think so. Right. Well, we'll find out. And he's got a manager who runs out. I think they're delicious. Just roasting. Yes, sir. So I take a picture of it. Mm. <laughs> nice. Yeah, baby. That is nice. So perfect. It's like perfect, like 80 degrees out. Perfect. Perfect weather. It's gonna be a nice sunset. Quiet. They got barbed wire on their heads. Are they? Is, was that barbed wire? Yeah. Uh, Has he been trying to get you down here for years? He he has been trying to get me down here. The Caribbean is not, you know. I, I mean, <clears throat> of the places I like to go, it's it, it'd be Asia. Southeast Asia, um, Latin America, parts of Europe.